<clears throat> now that's how far removed that orange crowd over there is from the real world that we live in and the people of Manitoba live in. Small business and agriculture is what makes the economy tick. We're going to grow this province, but we can't grow it with people that send you a bill when you take someone off of EI and give them a job. Ken. So the free press reporter stuck the mic in my face the other day and he says, what's your three-point plan? <laughs> I instinctively said, win. <laughs> That's three points there. W, work. And all the talking I'm going to do today ain't worth a pinch of nothing unless you go with a membership book and do I. Include. Include. Your friends, your family, your neighbors, the people in your great circles of influence who care about the future of this province. If you include those people in this party, and I know you will, we will be a better party because we will be a listening party that cares about Manitoba. What's the end? I want to hear you say what the end is. Anybody? No, no, that's W I N, but what's the end? Oh. And? <laughs> What's an N? N word. Come on. No. New. New. That's Esther's pick. Good call. New. A new face. A new hope. A new. That's good. I might use that. Keep going. Now. Now. Now I like the urgency. <laughs> we got about eight weeks to get these people signed up I'm talking about. So make sure you take books when you go today and we'll do that. I got one for you. Not the NDP. <laughs> <laughs> In three years, you just think about this, in three years we're going to go to the folks of Winnipeg and around Manitoba and we are going to say, and I guarantee this is the slogan already, what do you think, time for a change? <laughs> I like it. It's time for a change and what would be less advisable than for us to go to those same people and say it's time for a change, don't we look just like the NDP. <laughs> See, Duff Roblin, when he, uh, he barely won his first election, and in his bio, Ms. Thompson and I were talking about it, in his biography, he says, we got whooped, and we deserve to, because we went and told everybody it was time for a change, and then we forgot to tell them what the change was. <laughs> Look, at, we're not the NDP. We've got a proud heritage. This political organization is an awesome organization. Its history is powerful. It has had wonderful leaders, wonderful caucuses, giving everything to this province, opening the north, bringing health care, Medicare here, Tommy Douglas, Saskatchewan, Duff Roblin here, Sterling Lyon developing the best set of rules around the development of regulations ever developed and now in place in 10 Canadian provinces. And the father of the notwithstanding clause. Gary Fellman and his great team of people building a secure future by balancing the budget sensibly and well when they had massive double digit cuts. Not just a cap of 4%. The NDP is complaining the federal government isn't doing their job, but the NDP doubled the debt. So somebody needs to be accountable for that. So we're not the NDP. The NDP is a political party that has doubled our debt. We don't need two of those. <laughs>